Hello and welcome to Master Auto Reviews. My name is Vlad and in this video I will be showing you how to paint the rear brake drums of a 2015 Renault Captur. In this video I will be focusing only on the actual paint job. In case you would like to know how to remove and refit the brake drums, please check the video in the link above. Before we start, let's go through a list of equipment and tools that you will be needing. We start from the left. A power drill, a small wire brush, a medium wire brush, brake cleaner, masking tape, a knife, a small brush and two-in-one paint. Now. It is very important that you use 2-in-1 paint. 2-in-1 means it contains both paint and rust inhibitors. So this kind of paint adheres very well to already rusty surfaces and it protects them from further rust buildup. You can find this kind of paint in any hardware store. Just ask for this kind of 2-in-1 paint. Okay, so in order to paint a wheel drum you first need to clean it. As you can see there is already rust building up uh, on the entire surface as well as here some rust with, with dirt on the mating surface with the uh, wheels. I will be using a power tool with a wire brush and I will remove let's say as much rust as it can be possibly done yeah, without spending too much time. So let's get started. I will use a smaller wire brush for these uh, spaces here. Okay, so that's that's plenty of cleaning. Now the next step that we need to do is to degrease the wheel drum. For this I'm using a brake cleaner, aerosol, and I will be spraying it uh, all over the drum. Now we need to wait for it to dry off. So I would like to mask this surface here so that I make sure I do not get any paint in it. It is important that this surface stays as flat as possible because it's the mating surface with the wheel. So I'm using some masking tape and just put it like this. And 
and then do the cutting knife to cut the contour of this mating surface. Okay, now I will be breaking these pieces off. <clears throat> so, all nice and tidy. So, let's start painting. And, uh, then start with the top surface and just do it like this. Okay, so the paint job is almost done. Uh, the paint has almost dried. What I need to do right now is to remove this masking tape. So the reason I placed this here because I want the surface, this surface to not get paint on. Okay. So that's it, job done. Not the best looking the result, however it serves the purpose. It will protect the drum for further rust buildup. Okay, that was it. Thanks for watching. For any questions and comments, please use the comment section down below. If you like my content, please support the channel by subscribing. Goodbye.